Okay, in this video we're going to make the countdown timer on the end of round, and then at the end of the timer it's going to start a new round. Uh, so back into Unity and actually go back into our code. And most of it's going to be right in this end of round. Uh, you know, I'm just going to make a comment here while we're here. This is going to be, in the future, we're going to basically add the, uh, the increase for the next round. So I'll put something like increase missile speed or increase enemy missiles speed for next round here. So this will be the point here where it'll actually implement that later. But for now, uh, what we're going to do is we need to make a new text field here. So I'm just going to copy this and I'm going to call it uh, call it countdown text. That's all we really need for it. Okay, and let's go to the game controller. Okay, and it's gonna be this one. This will be the, oops, gotta go back to game controller. This will be the actual text number. What I'm gonna do is, we'll do, countdown text dot text equals and we're just going to do a simple three count so I'm not even going to make a variable we'll just do it here okay and then what we're going to do is just uh, yield return new wait for seconds do one second and then we're just going to copy this twice so we'll do two one and after this we are just going to call start round again So right now this won't actually make any changes to the new round, but uh, later when we, we we implement it where this comment is, it will. So I think that should actually be, oh, one other thing we gotta do is uh, in update. So when we call this, as soon as it hits zero missiles left, this is constantly being triggered. So we just gotta make a bool. We'll make bool uh, is round over. And then it'll be false. This. And then we add as uh, missiles are uh, equal to zero and not is round over. So this way this is only called once. So as soon as this is called here, we do is round over equals true. And then it should only call this once. Okay, I think that should be it. So let's try this out. So if this works, we should be able to finish around, get the score, it'll wait three seconds and then start a new round. Okay, so it's counting down. Okay, new round started, but we forgot to hide the screen. But other than that, it looks good. Let's go back to our code. And we can just take this one and we set it to false. And just, that should work fine, but just for the sake of it, I'm just gonna test it out. It's starting to look a bit boring. Might have to add the tracers sometime soon for it. Okay, and it... Uh, something didn't work out with the score, right? We'll have to check on that. Oh, it, it added, but it didn't update the UI, so that's just one other bug, so we can fix that. We just want to call this one. So we'll do that right here. So that should update any of the score. I don't think any of the other fields will matter. So I'm just going to try it one more time. Okay. 
So before it was updating the score, just not the UI text. So as soon as you, you blew up the first missile in the new round, then it would give you all the bonus points. And it's just little bugs like that that you got to work out as you go. Okay, so now we instantly got it. New round starts. And I'm just going to try finishing this one and make sure there's no issue on the second round, but it should be fine. Uh, one thing we forgot to increase the level though. Oh, and we forgot to reset the missiles. That's another, another bug. So we want to do Yeah, we'll update level text right after we start the new round. We'll also update the missile's left text. Oops. You know, I'm just going to change this to updating new round settings. And you know, oops. we're going to put that actually right here. So we'll do it right after the countdown. Uh, so for now, I'm just going to do. I'm just going to set the player missiles back to the same. And then later when we start upgrading the speed and stuff, we can change some of that. Okay, so at least that'll work. Now we'll leave this video here and we'll continue on.